Well, let's, let's look at uh, the paper fraud that we see going on. Uh, this is um, right here in Utah. Here, uh, the uh, headline is, here's why more than 400 mail-in ballots won't count. They mailed, they voted by paper, and they mailed them in to, and they won't count in Iron County. It says officials in Iron County are questioning how 415 uh, mail-in ballots were processed after nearly all of them were postmarked for the day after Election Day, June 25th. County Clerk John Whitaker explained at Monday's commission meeting that he received a pile of mail-in ballots on June 27th. Nearly 415 of them had June 25 postmark from the U.S. Postal Service Center in Vegas. Fourteen others also had that postmark in addition to stamps from postal service centers in Utah. That's what Whitaker said raised his suspicion. He believes there is no way all of those could have been late. Tiffany Matthews wasn't one of, was one of those ones that mailed it in on time. She claims that she dropped the ballot off in Cedar City at 2 p.m. on the 23rd. When she returned home from a trip later that week, she was told her ballot arrived late and would not be counted. Now, in that election, 415, uh, 415 ballots would have changed that election. Remember what we saw with the electronic voting? 